If you follow DC's movie universe, you would know that there was a lot of questions as to what was going on in the earlier stages of this universe. We had a ton of characters introduced so that they could have the Justice League movie, and a lot of movies got announced along the way that were supposedly supposed to happen, like A Man of Steel 2, which we never actually ended up getting, or we haven't gotten yet. And with all of that, some of these characters were believed to maybe have been completely forgotten about or cancelled all together. But it looks like one of these movies that maybe we had thought would be swept to the side actually now has an official release date, which changes a huge perspective for the DC movie universe. This character specifically, of course, is The Flash, who was supposed to get his own movie at some point, but after all of the controversy and weird reception that Justice League got, it seemed like the future of a lot of these characters were kind of left up in the air. Tie that to the fact that the actor who plays The Flash, Ezra Miller, was signed on for several other movie projects, his schedule definitely was seeming more vague. However, it does look like this movie will in fact be coming in a release date of July 2022. Now, this definitely seems a little bit far off if you think about it, this release coming in about two and a half years from now. And while that is quite a ways off, it's really interesting if you think about it, considering this will be a long way from his attack attachment to the film Justice League, which came out a couple of years back. Still, we're seeing the DC Universe kind of announce these films that are quite a ways off, but at least solidifying dates for them, which can get fans excited for. Because there was so many movies earlier on that were announced but never given dates that have just seemed to lose all of the traction that it maybe had in the earlier days. The one concerning thing, of course, about this is that The Flash getting his own movie in July of 2022 means that there's probably going to be a large audience that won't remember this character, which could be a good thing, but it also could be a bad thing at the same time. This character obviously has a storyline that started up in the Justice League movie, and it's going to be interesting how they're going to tie that up in the year 2022 and decide whether to continue the story or work on a fresh reboot or fresh start with the character. But we've also seen characters do well like Aquaman, but of course that movie did come out a lot closer to the release of Justice League. So it's going to be interesting how they end up handling Ezra Miller's character as The Flash. Honestly, we were starting to think that if they were going to make a movie, they would recast an actor to play Flash because of how busy this actor is. Yet, it looks like he's signed on. They probably now have a scheduled time for him to film this movie. And things are actually really starting to look up for the DCEU for the first time in a really long time. So we wanted to go ahead and turn this around to you guys, see what you guys are thinking. Are you excited for this movie? or do you think that it's so far off that it's not going to be as effective as if they were maybe releasing an announcement in the next year for a release? Let us know what you're thinking though. Be sure to subscribe with notifications on though for more updates and news just like this and we'll see you all next time with a brand new video. Bye guys. I'm about to. Hi everybody. Hey everybody. How you doing? Hi. <laughs> Mm -hmm. See you guys.